So in today's video, I'm having a bit of a look at the Lenovo IdeaPad Flex 5. This particular one was purchased on special off Amazon with the following specifications. We have got a Ryzen 5 4500U, 16 gig of RAM, a 256 gig SSD, the integrated Vega graphics, 14 inch touchscreen, three cell battery, now on this particular one, I have changed the SSD over to a 500 gig Crucial P1 NVMe SSD. But anyway, let's take a look and see what we get. So to begin with, usual paperwork, which basically is quickly skim read and forgotten about. One different thing in, included is this stylus pen which most companies are normally charging for. As you can see, it runs off a AAA battery, which I am curious to see how that will go. It's something I don't normally use. And one other thing that was included in this particular one was a 65 watt Type-C charger. It's got the US power lead, which I'll be throwing that away and replace it with an Australian one. But I thought that was rather neat. The appearance of the machine I find to be rather simplistic and also pretty darn good. At a glance I like the, the front facing speakers, fingerprint scanner and also a relatively large trackpad. The screen itself is reasonably bright, it's brighter than I was, was actually expecting, but there is a fair bit of bleed going on with this in dark rooms which I'll show later on or possibly in a future video. Down the bottom, we have a look at, look at the I.O. We have headphone jack, Type-C, also charging, HDMI, but then we've also got a DC jack here as well. So that's a bit interesting, I find that even though this particular one came with the Type-C charger, there are models that don't. If we go around to the other side, there's really not too much here. We have two USB 3s, SD card reader, and power button. So overall, for the price I paid for it, I've been impressed with it reasonably well so far, but I'll do some further testing and I'll put that up in another video. That will do for today. I'll catch us later. Bye.